Good morning, fishheads. Guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Hump day? Yep, it's Wednesday. Wednesday, January 23rd. Flying through this month, which is good because that means it springs right around the corner. Got a few pieces to show you this morning. Um, hey, let's get started. Got a shad fingerling. Lots of pearl on this. Uh, somebody was asking yesterday about a really good pearl to recommend. Um, there's a couple. The, the first and foremost that I would recommend, uh, if you're looking for a really good sheen and swirl, would be the Createx Candy 2.0. Those are really good. Also, these, this, this particular uh, fingerling, I painted with the FW and Dr. P.H. Martin pearls. Um, it shoots a little bit thinner, doesn't clog, and uh, really gives that metallic pearl pop to the bait. So this is in that shad fingerling. Love this bait. These are cute. These are the dingers, uh, the sevens, I believe is the size. And they'll, they'll run seven, eight feet, but They'll also do very well in, in shallow creeks. Um, if you just beat them off the rocks in the bottom, the bill holds up pretty decent on these. Going out later today, I've got three 1.5 double Ds. This one is in the molting crawl. It's that almost that spring peeper crawl. It's got that uh, Caribbean blue or Caribbean, whichever you choose to pronounce it like. And a leaf green, little hint of rust orange on the back, a little bit of rust orange on the throat, and then speckled in the rust orange across the, the bait. Just in time for spring. It's that molting peeper, molting craw. It's a Bama craw. Give you guys a shot on the shadowing and shading. And this is all done with an Iwata Eclipse. I don't use anything fancy at this point in the career. We're not doing the, the Micron, although I would love to. I think we've talked about that a couple times this week. But um, I can get plenty of detailing in with the HP Eclipse. So that is what I'm currently using. And then the money crawl. And you'll notice that from time to time I change up the stencils. Just kind of keep it fresh. Love paint and crawls. I think crawls are my favorite. I think I've been joking about it uh, being my spirit animal lately. I would agree. As far as in the fishing area goes, I love to paint crawls. And there's your money crawl. Will headed your way later this morning. These are fun. Love painting the Imperial Whites. And for these, the next batch, because I'm always painting them up, it seems like they're pretty popular in the late winter, early spring pre-spawn on these 110s. I've got red eyes on this one. And if you can see it, should still be able to see some of it. Maybe not as prominent on this one, but it is there. There it is. These are on holographic foiled baits. I think you can see the, the, the foiling a little bit more prominently on these others. It's in there. And this one's got the clear smoke eye. There's that, there's that flash. You can see it real good in this shot that holographic foil underneath coming through. You don't want to, you don't need to overdo it on foiled baits or chrome baits because you really want to be able to see that chrome. So just spray light because the heavier you spray, the less of this foiling you'll see. But you want to still be able to get that sheen. And then the blue-eyed version. And 
to finish it up with a couple of, you can really see the holographic foil in this, this is for another customer, also going out this morning, just finished dressing these up, obviously in the rainbow trout pattern, and you can really see that holographic foil underlay in this bait, and that's what you want to see. And I'll show you the other one as well, we did two, two of these for him. And that's all the news that's fit to print this morning. Thanks for hanging out with me. Next up, I think you guys are going to be seeing a spray session this coming weekend. I'm going to take tomorrow off, tomorrow being Thursday, and uh, do a little fishing myself as long as the weather permits. I don't know if we're supposed to get snow or not, but if not, you can catch me on the water. We'll see you guys later. Thanks for hanging out. As always, it's good company. I appreciate you guys spending some time with the channel. Happy casting from Jekyll Bates. Yeah, 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 you're right, I forgot. Another one, and that black and copper scroll. Now your day is complete. Go about your business now. I've shown you everything, for now. <laughs> we'll see. You.